They're dispatched in the Rising Sun Gold Challenge. Matador Man, as usual, lost five, six lanes when the starters hit go. Undercover agent Cirillo is right there. Socrat is on the outside. The Philly Lady in Black is near the rail. Rainbow Bridge is a little bit keen on the outside. And Do It Again is in the yellow up the rail. About six lengths off the leader. Then New Caledonia. And at the back of the field, Matador Man starts to pause. So Rillo now takes them towards the 1100 meter by two. Undercover agent is second and Lady in Black at the rail third. Socrat is in the blue. Rainbow Bridge and Do It Again. They travel together about five or six lengths off the leader. Then mounted all man New Caledonia. They move to the 800 in the Rising Sun Gold Challenge and Cirillo leads it. Undercover agent, Socrat ready to strike. Lady in black, Rainbow Bridge is on the outside. Do it again, has got five lengths to track down, then Matador Man. And behind that, New Caledonia. Homeward bound and Cirillo leads it. Undercover agent, Lady in black. Rainbow Bridge and do it again. They shoulder to shoulder, taking off together. 300 meters to go. Cirillo, Lady in Black. Down the inside, do it again. Rainbow Bridge is also trying to put in a claim, but Cirillo still holds on. Cirillo, do it again. And then Rainbow Bridge has to come around them. Cirillo from do it again over the last 50. It's close. Do it again. One out. Second to Cirillo. Socrat and Rainbow Bridge involved for third and fourth in a close third and fourth. But the Rising Sun Gold Challenge, do it again, has done it again. Terrific win from do it again. And this one, Richard Faree, the twice over, Justin Snaith. And number two, uh, number one is victorious. You'll see he pulls out that extra just when Cirillo looked as though it had it. And it pulls that extra out and ends up winning it by about a neck or so. The twice over. Nick Johnson, Bernard Cantor and the late Jack Mitchell. And an elated Justin Snaith and his team. They're about 20 meters away from us here in their box win it. Cirillo second. Rainbow Bridge and Socrat very close. Maybe Rainbow Bridge third and Socrat fourth. So we wait for the judges then undercover agent. Rainbow Bridge, just look at that. That's got the red sleeves. Now, Cirillo leads it. Let's just see there. Rainbow Bridge is going to go in for a run. And then Lady in Black gets checked. And then Rainbow Bridge has to come around them. But then do it again in the yellow. Now goes to Cirillo. They have a terrific struggle. And do it again. Gets up in the last two jumps. And elated Richard Faree. They win Rising Sun Gold Challenge. We'll wait for their judges on third and fourth. Back to the studio. Well, they're just as they cross the line for the 2019 Group 1 Rising Sun Gold Challenge. The rain has come down. It's not too serious, but uh, we've just got an uh, umbrella for protection for the winning connections. And uh, joining us uh, for the winning presentation a bit later will be uh, Mr. Babu Nanan. And we also got Mr. Vijay Maharaj. But let's uh, first up talk to the winning jockey, who is none other than Richard Fouri. Richard, uh, the, the first question will be, what happened in the parade ring? Well, <laughs> the start asked us just to do one more round and he didn't want to have any take in that and uh, he started getting upset and Justin came running, screaming, he said, no, 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 this was must go out now before something goes wrong. Uh, it was a good call, he went to with his pony, kept him nice and relaxed and then at the start he didn't want to load, you know, he obviously knew what's coming, we're going to have to race, um, but you know, his demeanour was right. We've had more time with him than with our other horses, you know, start of the season so we could prepare, prepare him better. Um, but yeah, it's a lovely horse in the race, the pace was on, had four lengths to make up, came into the straight and I had so much horse underneath me, I just had to look for a parking. And then, yeah, the race started unwinding and, you know, he was there when I needed him. He's a, he's a true champion and he just showed his uh, class, he doesn't need to, too many gallops to come into this race, he's, he's just that good. He's a Vodacom Durban Delight champion, he's now announced himself to the public all around the country. What's your thoughts going into the big race after this performance? Well, I think a lot of people will be a lot more confident in him now. He's, they've seen that uh, you know, he needs one run, but he just won his first run. Yeah, so his next run is his best run. We're going into the, into the July ready horse. He's fit. We've got three weeks to make sure that everything goes accordingly. Lovely horse. Thank you to the wonderful owners, Mr. Johnson. Uh, you know, I've, I had some pressure with this horse. 
Uh, I didn't quite shine on him on Mete, um, but saying that he wasn't there underneath me that day, but today, different animal. He's a phenomenal miler. Um, just glad the team, Justin, Jono, Mr. Snaith, I'm just delighted to ride for them. And to all our staff, again, they've done such a phenomenal, do phenomenal job. And then to my wife, uh, I've been away for a while. She hasn't seen me, so I have to dedicate this one to her. And then also to Gavin, he's uh, been driving me up and down to Summerfeld day in, day out. And just, you know, just, just pity he's not here. He's not feeling well. Uh, but yeah, to Gavin, thanks so much. Hello, Richard. Thank you. Lovely. Let's get uh, Justin Snaith in. And uh, Justin, just outstanding the way you brought this horse back. I mean, it is his first run here back in a province that he loves and that's dear to him and he's come through with a five-star performance i'm actually getting nervous this is the closest you and i've been together <laughs> under <laughs> an umbrella as long as you don't start singing <laughs> coming back to the race how yes. was the mood prior uh look very very nervous uh, we had a few hiccups in the parade ring and i could see his head was starting to turn he's a, a horse he's very very intelligent uh, one of the most intelligent horses I've ever, and I've raised him from a young uh, racehorse and just so careful. And today, the, the warnings were there. He was getting annoyed. He went to the start, and, and he, thank goodness, Malan, we flew Malan in, uh, who is fantastic, who's been really good in dealing with him, with his, his issues. Um, it's like a, having psychologists on a horse, and uh, it just really has take, helped him turn into the horse he is. But to come back from, I think it's five and a half months, he hasn't seen the racetrack. Uh, I want to thank Gold Circle for all the effort in allowing him to come so the public could see the gallop. And I think that's very important. Uh, every, everything's an open book about us. And we, if we could have every punter going home with money in their pockets, it would certainly make my day. To everyone who's involved in this, to Nick Johnson, his lovely family here to enjoy it, to Bernard Cantor and the whole Mitchell family. It's just been an absolute, you know, he's proven today. He is the best weight for age horse in South Africa. He's proved it in Cape Town. He proved it last year in the July. We're 12 months down the line and he's proved it again. This is the best weight for age horse in South Africa at the moment. And I'm just so proud to be part of it. And to, you know, everyone at Drakens saying where he was raised as a young horse, everyone feels like they, they, they own a piece of him. And, you know, as I said, thank you to everyone that's been involved. Richard, uh, you know, just amazing day, unbelievable racehorse. Wish you all the best in your preparation and the lead up to the 2019 Vodacom Durban July five star performance here, Justin. Well done. Great, thank you very much. Let's get Nick Johnson in now. Nick Johnson is an absolute soldier because everybody's got umbrellas, but Nick Johnson said, I am going to stand in the rain. Nick, mostly, I mean, this horse has given you so much of joy. Yeah, he's an amazing horse, Tease, and uh, we're incredibly lucky to own him. Um, obviously, I, I, I'm here alone today. Uh, Bernard is not here, and obviously Jack, sadly not. But uh, what a horse! Now, when he won the Vodacom Durban July, that was the, the first taste of a great horse that he's announced himself to the South African racing public in Cape Town. You know, he, he did you proud there as well. Yeah, he had he had an amazing season to to have run a very close third behind Eagle Eagle in the Greenpoint Stakes after six months off and then yes. uh, win the Queen's Plate and then uh, ran a, a good race to run second uh, in the Met from a really, you know, a, a poor position. He had a hell of a season. Um, you know, he, he's, a, he's an amazing horse and uh, we're incredibly lucky to own him. Justin is an incredible trainer. He has incredible patience. Uh, he, he takes care of the horses so beautifully and I'm so grateful that uh, that this horse is with, is with him and uh, we're having a lot of fun with him, uh, with this horse. Well, you've uh, announced your name for the Vodacom Durban July and uh, after this performance, he's a horse that could certainly come out and defend it. So that, that should be fair comment. Well, uh, I'm not sure if it's fair. I think he announced himself a long time ago, not today. Um, you know, he's, he's an amazing horse. Anton Marcus, who's not riding him, has been telling me for the last you know, year that he's the best horse in the country. Uh, so, so I, I think you know he's just proved today that he, what, what a good horse he is. He hasn't run for five months, um, and to come back and win a race of this magnitude, with with, uh, with the horses of this magnitude, is quite incredible. Well, we our thoughts are with the Mitchell family. Give our best to Bernard Cantor and well done to you, Nick. Thanks so much, Dees. Well done to everybody concerned here. The winning connections of Do It Again. We'll break and join you back shortly for the winning presentation.